I'm Kat Greenleaf. Welcome to Talk Stoop here on My Stoop in Brooklyn. And here on My Stoop in Brooklyn <laughs> is Miss Jackie Reed. Hello. Hello. Cheers. You're on a reality show. Yes, I am. Let's talk about Pep. Let's talk about Pep on yes. VH1. Yes. Why would you decide as a journalist mm -hmm. and a commentator to then go and be part of a reality show? I haven't even talked about this with my mother. Well, I definitely wanted to take my career in a different direction. I've been, I did local news, then I transitioned into network news doing, you know, BET. And it was a phenomenal show. CBS and ABC, I've been on The View. This is a great country. I wouldn't want to live anywhere else. Da, 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 and I've CNN, done, right? Yeah, and CNN too, yes. So I've done so many things in news and I really wanted to do something different. It's nice. Gets on my last freaking nerve. Four black women mm -hmm. talking about romance, sex, life in New York City. Yeah. I'm ready to get my feet wet again. Stars. Pat from Salt and Peppa. And so she was big in the mid 80s as a hip hop artist. Yeah, and it's in the 90s, yeah. How do you even bring that up? At a dinner table, past the bread. By the way, can I have your sperm? It's a way of dealing with issues that I have that I'm sure other women, other people can relate to and telling another story. Okay, what are they? Give us your issues right now and we'll solve them here on Talk Stoop. All right, numero uno. I would like to have a baby before I get to the point where I cannot have a baby anymore. Unfortunately, women, unlike men, you know, we have that cutoff point, the whole biological clock thing. And how old are you? I don't tell. Oh, no. Yeah. Okay. But my doctor did say to me, if you want to get it done, you better get it. If you're interested in dating Jackie, email me, cat, C-A-T dot greenleaf at NBCUNI.com, and I will hook it up. Okay, say it twice. Just not. <laughs> cat, C-A-T dot greenleaf at NBCUNI.com. How are you going to be effective at the RNC convention? What are the similarities between being on a reality show and being a journalist? When you talk to people on your show, how is it like talking to Barack Obama and Bill Clinton? Yeah. Oh, that's different. Barack Obama, very laid back, very down to earth. It was, it was hugely gratifying. It was a great honor. Very in the moment, very present. I appreciated uh, the opportunity to do it. Bill Clinton, a lot more thoughtful in his responses. Well, I don't think that he should try to be somebody he's not. Almost perfect with the answers. Do you miss being a journalist? Do you miss being a reporter and an anchor? I do when there are big stories going on that I want to be a part of. I like um, educating people and informing them. But you are on the radio now every day. I'm with D.L. Hughley. It's a D.L. Hughley show, once again, second fiddle. And I noticed you're doing another show also on the radio. Oh, the Tom Jordan Morning Show, which is nationally syndicated. We talk about issues like, you know, how to have a better orgasm or something. Oh my God. Yeah. She said go orgasm there. on the scoop. Okay, so how do you have a better orgasm? <laughs> oh, shoot. <laughs> we can keep going. <laughs> you made me Woo, spill made my tea. Your toes taste like meatloaf. Meatloaf? Let's talk about Pep on VH1. Yes. When? Monday nights at 1030. Be there. Thank you for being here. Thank you. Great this to talk to you. Really. <laughs>